Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have been to Aldi for my weekly shop. Um, last week I went to, well I didn't go to Asda, it was delivered to me. Um, I spent £119 in Asda last week and I did say, I'm so out of breath. One minute, I've just been marching around the house sorting stuff out. <sighs> yeah, so I spent £119 on Asda shopping last week. It was a delivery and I did say I'm not spending that much next week. I jinxed myself because my shopping has come to £119 again. Bearing in mind though, it is Easter. I did get something for Izzy's forever bed. I've obviously got the... Um, Easter eggs for people, I've, you know, I didn't go mad on the Easter eggs, I've only got a couple of little ones, um, but I also got some of the different creams that Aldi is doing at the moment, I did so go to see Asda, Aldi, so yeah, I've got some of their special buys, so I thought I would um, give them a go and show you guys what they're like, because they're a bit pointy. Yeah, let's get into it. So if you want to see what I've been buying this week from Aldi, just continue to watch. So, first bag oh, is a big red Aldi bag. First thing, I got some of their Lunex Ultra towels for that time of the month. It's not yet, but I wanted to just get some in because they, I swear they're 55p. I will check the receipt i'll try and put the prices on the screen for you either here here or down here probably down here but yeah so they're, they're really really cheap and they are identical to the always ultra with wings so recommend those if you use the always i've got some lightly seeded bread i've been buying white bread recently and it's not good on the old tummy, so I thought I would go back to the seeded again. So, got me some of that. Um, I did go and buy the Yorkshire tea bags. They do the big, big boxes. Now, at the moment, I'm drinking PG Tips because I got it on some sort on one of the Deliveroo or Go Puff apps when I was poorly, because um, that's the only tea they had, and I'm not enjoying it at all. I'm a, I'm a Yorkshire tea girl. But they were five pounds, what were they, six pounds something? I think they used to be, they used to be 4 99 for the big box and I think they're now five pound 49. So I've gone for the Diplomat gold label. Um, these are like a little bit of a dupe of the Yorkshire tea in my eyes. It just says everyday round tea bags. So I'm gonna give them a go. Um, I have had the Aldi tea bags before. And they're actually quite nice. Um, like yesterday, the sun has decided to come out and shine straight through the window. It looks like it's going to disappear behind a cloud in a minute. So just ignore that for a moment. <clears throat> right. I've got Isabel some daffodils. My mum's got some for her as well. Because it's Easter. We love the daff. So I'm just going to pop those one of my little pots just put some water in it um snack wise this week i used to absolutely love these and i stopped buying them for some reason you can't get them in every shop but i think they are new to aldi they're the chili voice crackers and it does say limited edition on there but they're absolutely lovely um so yeah just got a little bag of those i thought i'd get these to show you that they've got in these are the spicy nibbly bob not nibbly bobblies nibbly nobblies and they look just like the spicy knickknacks um now these were quite pricey i think these were 89p for how many grams 80 grams um but like it's literally like that but you know i like getting these things just to show you just to try them out so you don't have to and then i'll tell you what they're like and if i think they're nice you can go give them a try yourself and I will let you know, I come here. I've got Rocky some of these mini bone treats with chicken, lamb, chicken beef and lamb. Um, so it just says for puppies and small breeds. So it's great for Rocky. 
because it's a French Bulldog, if you don't know already, if you're new here, welcome. I have actually noticed that I've got a few new subscribers this week, so welcome to my channel. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, because it really, really makes me happy when I see my subs go up. Um, and all the messages as well, loving all your messages. I am going to reply to a load of them after I finish this, so yeah. If I haven't replied already, I will be. So yeah, getting back to these, they say I'm new, so I've got some of them from Rocky. Um, I've got some of these soft bakes, so these are just like the Balvita um, soft bakes. These are the filled ones, so I've got the strawberry, and I've got the taco hazelnut. Matthew really likes those. Because it's Easter, I've got me and Matthew some Cadbury's cream eggs. We love a cream egg. Uh, biscuits this week. I've just got some milk chocolate digestives. Um, so yeah, chocolate digestives. They're just the old ones. Now, I've gone for the Everyday Essentials Penne Pasta. Um, I picked up this packet and then the, the other Aldi branded one, which is, you know, looks a bit posher. I put them together and literally the ingredients was the same, they look the same, but they're half the price. So I'm going to give these a go. I'm pretty sure they are the same thing. I know this is very naughty, but I'm absolutely in love with these at the moment. They are the cinnamon buns, swirled with cinnamon filling and topped with sweet cream cheese icing. Now, I did buy some of these from Asda last week. They were more expensive than these ones from Aldi and they were awful. I do not recommend the ones from Asda at all. They were dry, they were really doughy, they, they were not good. Not good. Right, so I've got Matthew a bottle of Coca-Cola Zero. He likes his Coke Zero. I used to buy the cans, but I've, I've started buying bottles now because if I had bought a multi-pack of cans today, we would have been looking at around £125. So, yeah. Put it down a bit and I've started buying bottles. Um, I bought myself some of the Spritz Light Red Grape Sparkling Fruit Juice. This is just like the slur. Um, I absolutely love slur. I like the white one as well, but I just thought I'd get myself some of the, the red grape one. So, just treat myself. Um, got a couple of packs of the instant noodles. Um, just the, the Aldi ones. Just having a cupboard, getting low on them. Got two tins of peeled plum tomatoes. This sun doesn't seem to be giving up now, does it? I've got two packs of the chicken and mushroom flavour pasta and sauce. I have got a couple of packs in the cupboard, but I just I like to have them in just just in case I'm having a bad day, like a poorly day or something, and they're so easy just to you know make on the hob. Uh, just like the penne, I've gone for the everyday essentials spaghetti. I really fancied spaghetti the other day. We didn't have any, and I, I wanted bolognese and spaghetti, so. Probably going to make a bolognese this week. Um, I've got some roasted and salted pistachios. And I've gone for the thick cut ridge meaty variety crisp. So just a six pack. Uh, I've got some double deckers. These are even smaller. Look at that. Absolutely tiny. You get four in a pack. Got Matthew a bottle of orange Lucasade. Here's the other treats I got from Rocky: the mini nibbles with beef and cheese. So they're new as well. They look good. Come on, Stern, give up. I thought it was going to go behind the clouds, but it doesn't seem to want to. I'm sorry about this, guys. Got some knoppers because when you shop at Aldi, you have to buy. Knoppers, knoppers, whatever you call them. <laughs> I got some allergy relief tablets. I'm getting low on the... These are the cetirazine ones. I do use loratadine as well, so they're both the same, really. I've got 
some Sensodyne Gentle Whitening Toothpaste. Some Paracetamol. Literally took the last two the other day. Got some extra Wrigley's Strawberry Flavour Multi Pack Chewing Gums. Um, they had these in um, Aldi today in the special buy. So this is the pineapple and coconut glass cleaner. Really need to clean my windows and my French doors. Uh, pineapple and coconut. Oh, I did have a whiff in the shop. I couldn't help. I couldn't help it. And it smells beautiful. And then I also got the same one. Oh no, this is slightly different. This is the coconut lime breeze. Oh, that smells really nice as well. And this is the laundry cleanser. So, I love this laundry cleanser. It's really, really good. When, you know, you get that sort of like stagnant, like horrible smell sometimes. You know, when you, your washing machine is a bit clogged and that just, it works great. Until you can clean your washing machine out. Uh, these were on offer, these Star Drops, Power Drops, Lavender Dreams Floral. Um, these were down to 69p um, and they're the concentrated disinfectant. So I put them in, so I've been using like an old little spray bottle. This is, this is an old Dettol antibacterial one. And I've been putting a bit of this in water and just spray my sides down, wipe over a bit of kitchen towel. So yeah, 69p, I think that's great. Pop there. They've got their laundry scent boosters back in again. So I've gone for the Blossom one this week. Uh, it says it does just 15 washes. Um, and it's by Almat. Oh, they smell quite nice, actually. Yeah, they're quite powerful. Uh, give them a go. I've basically been mixing mine in an old jar so i've got the blue ones and the pink ones you know the lenore so i'll bung them in with them and it smells beautiful and from the so this is from the special buys this is the Lacura detoxifying and brightening purifying pink clay mask um so i've got some of that and it comes with like a little brush on the top just to brush it on so i thought that was really cute and it just looks like let me get it out it looks really cute i don't know whether it's a dupe of something i will have a look and i'll pop it on the screen if it is a dupe um but yeah so, and then do you know what i've been wanting to try this get bang out of the way i've been wanting to try this for ages and i kept thinking mm, shall i because it's 7 99 but I'm pretty sure it is definitely dupe or something. I just can't remember what it is, but I will put it on the screen, like I said. Uh, this is the Lacura Caviar Illumination Anti-Age Day Cream. Luxury Caviar Extract and Snow Algae Extract. Formula for radiant and luminous skin. So I just thought that was so posh. It's got SPF 15 in it. And look how bougie this looks. Now that a bit of bougie like i said it's 7.99 it's got a little thing on it it smells nice give it a try oh that does feel like a lovely cream so I'm looking forward to using that tomorrow. Right, so that's it for that bag. I'm just going to quickly move this stuff out of the way and we'll get on to the second bag. Right, so before I move on to the second bag, I just want to show you the, the bits and bobs that I've got for Easter. So I've got two of the sort of medium-sized Cadbury's cream egg Easter eggs. So you get one large egg and one cream egg in there. And then look how cute these are. These are the mini eggs um, with mini eggs, Easter egg with mini eggs inside. I just think they're so cute. 
I've got three of those, so they're to give out to people. I'm not going to say who. And I've got this for Izzy. This is an Easter Wonders Easter LED tree with 50 warm white, pink, blue, and purple for indoor use. How cute is that? Can you see that? That is so cute. Oh, it actually comes with batteries as well. That's so cute. So what I'm going to do, I will, I'll put the batteries in, but I will wrap it all up in cling film, and then I'm going to stand it up in a pot. So all these will like pull out like a Christmas tree. Um, I'll pop it in a pot so the batteries are like covered and then I've got them white stones I don't, don't know whether you've seen my haul that I did the other day the Wilco's, Aldi, Tesco all that and um, I've got those white stones from Bargain Buys um, so I will cover the bottom of this with the stones as well and um, yeah so yeah that's going to look so cute I need a screwdriver to open that up but yeah they give you the batteries as well so I think that's pretty cool. That was $9.99. Um, you know, I'll probably be able to use it every year. I have actually been coming in some little eggs that I bought from Amazon. They're little wooden eggs. Let me just go and get them and I'll quickly show you. They came like this. They paid $9.99 for these, but they're so many. Two packs of the wooden eggs and I've been doing these at my mum's today I did do a little bit of footage but I'm going to put that in my daily vlog tomorrow um, I'll just quickly show you a couple of them so did that one a lot of little gold one stars and then that one's got little flowers on it how cute is that how cute yeah that was quite relaxing today so i'm going to do some more of them tonight um and they will then hang up izzy's little easter tree so we'll be decorating tomorrow so i will vlog when we decorate for her little easter forever bed right what you've been waiting for second and final bag this has got all my cold stuff in so this is my little pool bag that's just brilliant just keep everything really cool right first thing i got was some handmade stratford blue cheese um this is for matthew to go on crackers he's absolutely loving blue cheese at the moment so he finished one off yesterday he had for lunch while he was walking from walking working from home so i thought he's probably gonna want some of that next week um, I bought a 250 gram lean beef steak mince, 5% fat. I just thought I'd make a spaghetti bolognese this week for dinner. Really fancy in that. I've got Matthew a fillet steak because he hasn't had one for weeks. So I thought I'd treat him for one of those. Um, this is just for a little lunch. It's a potato and onion tortilla. So Spanish omelette basically. Um, they are quite easy to make they do take quite a long time but i just thought that one is cute for a lunch yummy um i've got this for lunch as well this is prawn cocktail in a mary rose sauce i thought we could have this in a sandwich with some cucumber maybe some lettuce um i have got some lettuce left last week i'm not sure how it is but if it's gone back we'll just have cucumber in it got some leeks um, I think I'm just going to whack these straight in the freezer. So I'll either make a leek and potato soup or I will make a another pie with them. So yeah, just got them for the freezer. Uh, got us a strawberry trifle. So we'll have this over the weekend. It's, it's up until the 6th of April. So this will probably be our Sunday pudding. And then we'll probably finish it next Monday got some nectarines 
some strawberries. These are the specially selected bursting with flavour strawberries. Um, there's not many in there, but they look pretty delicious. And they were cheaper than the, the normal pack, so I don't know what's going on there. Um, got a mozzarella ball. I always like to put this in my pasta dishes. I've got some Lincolnshire sausages. Um, we did. We had these with jacket potato, spicy beans and cheese a couple of weeks ago and Matthew really enjoyed it so he said please get some more of those sausages so I recommend these if you're a sausage fan <laughs> anyway I got some dry cured smoked streaky bacon some potato slices these are great in the air fryer recommend them I've got some baby butter mushrooms. I'll put these in my spaghetti bolognese. I've got some Hunter's chicken. So we'll have, we had this with jacket potato the other day, um, but I do want to make that mac and cheese again. Matthew absolutely loved it. So I put this um, in the air fryer, crisp it up, chop it all up and sprinkle it over the mac and cheese. It's delicious. I've got one of them. Uh, ran out of cheese so got some mature cheddar you should see the clouds out there now they're just going over the sun they are black i've got my ring light on as well ready i've got some mozzarella and cheddar cheese mix so i've got this for the mac and cheese to go in it on the top yums some finger chilies so this will be for a curry i think i'm going to make a lentil curry this week and i'll also put mushrooms in that as well i've got some wonky parsnips really fancied doing these in the air fryer with some carrots uh, maybe some chicken some mashed potato and gravy thinking i've got some chicken in the freezer so yeah we'll probably just have that for sunday lunch um got some cajun fries just just to have as like a quick tea with something um for give them a try i think we have had those before i got them for marcus but i don't think we tried them um uh, got some filtered semi-skimmed milk four pinter some Ice split, so these are just like fabs. A orange and mango juice, and just a bottle of the orange juice smooth. So have those in the fridge, and I think that is it. Yep, I've got my receipt here. So, but I was just packing my bags away, and this was still in the bag. I got some Lacura Vitamin C Brightening Eye Cream. So let's open it up and have a look at this one as well. So how cute is that? Look at that. You see that? Take a look Cute. So yeah, got some of that as well. Oh, it smells quite nice as well. So yeah, I thought there was something else. I missed it. So I'll whack this in while we're showing you the creams, but this is way after I came off the vlog. Yeah, so I'll be popping the prices on the screen, like I said. And let me just get you the total. You see down the bottom there, it is a hundred and nineteen pounds eighty-seven. It's a lot of money it's a lot of money but i've got a lot of things so mm, shopping is getting expensive and i'm not going to keep going on about it because i say it every time i don't know it's just i think i do overbuy but you know i think i'm going to start trying to cut back a little bit and um yeah just just maybe trying to use what i've got again in the freezer in the cupboards and uh see what meals we can make out of that but anyway so it has gone really dark outside now i've got my ring light on so that's why you can still see me otherwise you would not see me 
but I really enjoyed going back to Aldi today. I haven't been there for weeks and um, I mean, I did get, I popped in last Friday, but just got three things, but I didn't do a full shop there. And um, yeah, I was looking forward to going back this week. So yeah, it was nice. So yeah, I'm gonna go now, put all this stuff away. Um, like I said yesterday, if you need to talk to somebody and you you know you you're down or you're struggling with your mental health or you're struggling like struggling with say a medical condition then please just reach out to me you know send me either a message like a comment or send me a message on my instagram i'll pop my instagram here um my email i'll pop here as well it's all also in the description box below. So yeah, if you just if you want to reach out to me and have a chat, it's always best to talk. Don't hold it in. Um, if you can't talk to family and friends, then you know talk to me. I'm I'm here, and I will try and reply to you as soon as I can. Um, but I will I will always reply to your messages. I'll just try my best to get back to you as quick as I can but anyway yeah I'm gonna go now if you're not subscribed already like I said hit that subscribe button also hit that thumbs up button because it really helps my channel along and leave me a comment and also share my channel share it on all your socials share it with your friends your family everyone share the love so anyway I'm gonna go now thanks for watching guys and I'll see you all soon bye